Golf time, boys. Great putt, good start. Sits one over. Trails by four strokes. Kenny Benton. Short par three, slight tail in. Little uphill. Should be a great shot here. Well struck. Looking great. Looking absolutely great. Easy par, or easy birdie putt. Ooh, not so easy. But he drains it. Gets even here. Trailing only by two strokes. Three hundred forty-nine par four. Not bad. Just a light breeze out today. Strikes the middle of the fairway. No problem at all. Up 13 yards. Hoping for a bump and run. Not going to be good. Poor shot. Bad club selection. All around, piss poor. Gets on, has a chance to salvage par. And he does. Well played.
Donald McDonald sitting at minus four. Four strokes under. Quite a good lead. Get a good kick. Mm. Indeed he does not. Just going back to safety here. Hits the fairway wood. Well struck. Oh, and it just misses the cup. Unbelievable. Drains the par putt. Birdie putt. Another par four here. Quite a winding fairway. Very well struck. Does it stay dry? It does. Just a little lofter here. Good shot. Great approach. Has a chance at birdie. A lot of break right to left. Gonna have to be careful. Not enough on it. Piss poor. Salvages par. Donald, Donald McDonald sitting at five under. The rookie, four strokes to go. Quite a long par four here. Wind's starting to pick up as we get closer to the water. It's well struck, should be down the middle. Great opportunity for a second shot. Good choice to club up. Another tough read here. That's a very bad putt. What a fucking idiot. Just absolutely shanking it. <sighs> Gets him back to even. Time to hike up the skirt. Sitting five strokes behind Donald McDonald. Another hell of a par four. It's well struck. Right down Broadway. Looking good, looking very good. Sinks the birdie. Donald McDonald drops a stroke. The rookie, three strokes away. Great shot. Avoids the water. Manageable birdie. And he sinks it. Very well played. He's in the hunt. But Donald McDonald gains another stroke. Still sits three behind. Not a bad drive. 
268 yards. Really ought to hit the weight room. Not enough. Chipping from the fringe. Gonna be a tough par putt. Really missed that one. Not sitting in good shape here. Good lag. Needs to hit that. Double bogey. mile an hour tailwind poorly hit does it stay in the fairway indeed all the effort to get two under loses it a really long birdie putt here suffice it to say I don't think he'll hit it Very poorly hit. Should be manageable putt here. Losing all the momentum. Heavily behind Donald McDonald for the lead. Six strokes. He's well struck. Splits Main Street. Very good approach. Should be an easy chip on. Well, well played. For birdie. Aiming about left cup. And he hits it. Needed that one. Sits five behind McDonald. Here comes hole 13. Another par three. Hits that one really well. Looks great, but it's a little long. Needed to get under it a little more. Great approach, though. We'll salvage a par putt the short game has not been a strong suit tonight here he goes Good drive, 267 yards, very consistent. Probably do a lot better without high heels. Oh, what a bad shot. Very slow coming up. 
Gonna need to get really close here. Bumps it too hard. No chance at par here. Very poorly played. This tournament is lost. For bogey. Good putt from 16 feet out. Struck well. This driver's not been the problem tonight. It's all in the iron game. This has good tempo. Not a bad shot at all. A lot of right to left break here for the birdie putt. Poorly played. Needed a little more on it. Sinks the par. Celebrates with a head nod. Quite embarrassing. Six strokes behind for McDonald. Sitting one over par. Another par three. Tailwind and downhill. Recipe for disaster. Still a little long, even after clubbing down. Just misses the cup, ends up being a little long. For par and he sinks it. The way this man plays, six feet, not a gimme. Poorly played, going for rough. Stays on the fairway, though. Find some brown shit. Gonna need a good recovery shot, salvage bar. Didn't get it. Poor tempo. Long par putt. Unbelievable. Sinks the 24 footer. Somebody get that man a beer. Par five needs to salvage an even score here. Not looking great, but it stays in the fairway. Three Wood's not going to quite get him there, it doesn't look like. Lays in a little short. Not a bad place to be. Going to need to aim to the right of the cup here with that break. Really, really bad shot for birdie. And he sinks it. Salvages an even score. Finishes tied for 24th.
We're here at the Creighton Championship, Tarwood Golf Course. Single round event. A little breezy out today. The rookie sits at hole one. It's a 422 yard par four. Fourth hole, hardest hole on the course. Strikes it well. Skies the bunker. Well played. Good start to the day. Looks like a five iron here. A little bit of a crosswind. May throw a wrench into things. Poorly played. Gonna need a miracle here. Expect him to get a little loft under this. And he does. Salvages a par putt opportunity. Sinks it. Good recovery. Gerald Doherty sitting atop the leaderboard with Jamie Dupont. Three strokes under. Tough green. Hard to guess what this is going to do. Ends up being a very difficult putt. Couldn't get it up on the table. Just misses that long birdie. Scratch golf. These kind of scores would do well in the LPGA. Here we sit, 496 yards to the flag. Five, a par five. One of the easier holes on the holes on the course. Stuttering a lot. I think the tequila is getting to me. Great shot selection. There's an eagle putt here. And he misses it. He's got LPGA written all over him. But he hits the birdie. Shocking. Here we sit. Short, short par four. One of the shortest holes known to man. Yikes. Still skies it. Gonna be hitting from the rough. Fear not. Manageable hole seal. Had a good recovery. Difficult birdie putt coming up. Looks straight away. Slightly down. Sinks it. Well played. Great recovery. Sitting only one stroke behind the leaders. Another short hole. Likes not to club up here, although it is uphill. Let's see how it fares out. Just misses the green. Sitting in the rough.
Great shot. Great shot. Achieves his par putt. Now sitting two strokes behind James McNulty and Jamie DuPont. Four hundred and seventy three yard par five should get to this in two shots. Very hectic crosswind here. Bad tempo, very poor. It's time to relax. See if he can get himself close. At least gets back onto the fairway. Should be able to hit the green in regulation now. Likes to club down a little bit here. Poor shot, tempo. Leaving himself a very difficult birdie putt. Very good lag, though. Very nice. Manages par. Could have been worse. James McNulty sitting alone at the leaderboard. Under five. It's almost as if there's no par fours on this course. Seven iron should do it here. Struck well. Going left of the cup and very long. Poorly played. Way too much power. Poorly judged. Not a bad putt there. Plus straight away. Four shots behind McNulty now. Seems to be running away with it. Not a good opportunity there. Finding the beach. Going all risk here. And he finds the water. Very poorly played. Didn't account for the wind. Could have laid in shorter. Very long, long bogey putt. Oh, and he hits the cup. Double bogey puts him at even. Momentum lost. A lot of rolling hills on this fairway. There's an opportunity here. Going to be a little wide left. Just misses. What a lag. Taps it in for par. Sitting here at even. Six strokes behind McNulty.
Right to left wind. See if he compensates for it. Well struck. Well struck indeed. Uphill six feet. Right to left wind coming. Hits it well. Going for the cup. Nope. Long and left. Comes back a little. A lot of left to right break here. But he sinks it anyways. Well done. Sitting five strokes behind McNulty. Downhill, a little bit of a tailwind. Gonna need a club down. Hits it all right, but it ends up on the fringe. Gonna need a lot of loft here. Just misses the cup. Tremendous effort. Should aim right cup here. Sinks it. Sitting one under. Tied for 12th. McNulty just running away with this tournament. Four and thirty-four yard par four. A lot of water around him. Let's see if he can avoid it. He does. Stays on the fairway even. He's got to go uphill eight feet here. Right to left wind coming out of the southwest. Shoots the cup a little long. Does get a little rollback. Not much. A lot of left to right. Just misses right of the cup. This one looks straight away. Sinks it. Good par salvage. Average length par five here. Likes to use the three wood. If it were me, I would have used the driver. Goes back to the three wood. Lays in short into the rough. Just gets on. Not a great start here. Quite a putt. Looking at 41 feet. Good lag. Just missed it to the left. 
Wait a second. Maintaining his one under. Not going to get him any wins. Has to get busy here. Well struck with the f hybrid. Plays in right. Comes back to the left a little. Sinks the birdie. Needed that one. Sitting at third. Four strokes behind McNulty. Only four holes to go. Needs McNulty to slip on his last hole here. Well struck. Heading for the cup. Doesn't get the roll he needs. Tough birdie attempt here. But he sinks it. Extremely well played. Sits only three strokes behind. Three holes to go. Not looking good here. Gets the kick to keep him out of the sand. Still quite a ways to go. Hits it well. Gets him back on the fairway. See if it's got enough to roll up. Not quite. Mostly straight here. Wonder if his husband plays. For par. Rough. Three strokes to go. Two holes left. Needs an ace here. This one looks like it's going to be good. Rolls a little long. Tough luck. Straight away hits the cup. Needs an eagle on hole 18. It is a par 5. Not a very long one. This hits the middle of the fairway. Needs to get close to the cup here. Not sure he's going to have it. Not enough. Needs to chip this in if he wants to win. Piss poor. Absolutely fucking piss poor.
Sinks the par. Overall, well played. Heading over to TPC Sawgrass. Players Championship, quite the event. Well struck, sits well on the fairway. It's beautiful here at Sawgrass. This is a great stroke, sits near the cup, but very well played. A little right to left here, uphill just a touch. Puts too much on it and hits the right side of the cup. Salvages par. Not a bad start. James McNulty, who's apparently a woman, sitting atop the leaderboard. Having a great year. Here's a well-struck ball. Can't get much better than that. Another well-struck ball. Going for the cup. Little long here. Not a well-engineered shot. Just misses the cup. Needs a little more left break on it. Gonna have to go uphill here. Hits it. Sitting one under. Let's take a look at his scorecard. Par is the first hole, birdie's the second. Not an ultra challenging par three here. Just basically straight away. Gonna be missing the cup a little bit here. Did not get the backspin he wanted. Shadow's playing havoc here. Misses the cup just left. Sinks it for par. Not too poorly played. Lance Sharp sitting atop the leaderboard now. McNulty. Apparently the gender reveal has played a distraction. There's a well-struck ball. Can't ask for a better opportunity right here. Looking for this ball to sit. And indeed it does. Well played. A lot of right to left here. But he sinks it anyways.
tied for second. Lance Sharp running away with the Players Championship. Third hardest hole on the course is a uh, par four, 420 yard. Dog leg right. Not super right, I guess. Just a winding fairway. Ooh. Need a little more mustard on that one. Manageable par putt, not an easy one. It's all downhill. If you miss, it will continue to roll. Didn't miss. Can't believe it. This asshole always misses. This one should be well struck. Unable to see with all these yagaloons. Sitting on the fairway. A little bit of an uphill shot here. Very well played. Could have went a little left. This one's fairly straight. Sinks it well. He's eating up. Strikes it well, should hit the middle. Not bad. Looking to grab some fat with this one. This is a bad shot. Very bad shot. Hate to be his family right now. Extremely embarrassing. But a good recovery. Should be able to manage par. Aim a little right of the cup, and you're good to go. He's home free. Lance Sharp, two strokes ahead. Just finishing up with hole 13. Needed to be a little more accurate with that shot. Quite difficult to say what he was thinking there. Not even a manageable par putt. Mm -hmm. Expect a two putt. A lot of right to left here. Not a lot of up and down. Doesn't have enough on it. As expected, a two putt coming. He sinks it. Even a girl could sink that one. Now sitting three strokes behind Lance Sharp, Donald McDonald working his way into second place. Last hole before we make the turn. 530 yard par five. Nothing but blue skies and white clouds out here today, folks. That's well hit. Hits the rough. Not far to go. Long, skinny greens here. It's a very good recovery. Seemingly possible par putt or birdie putt. 
And he shanks it to the right. Very disconcerting. Sinks the par. As we hit the turn, we take a look at the leaderboard. Lance Sharp, 600, Donald McDonald. 300, one stroke ahead of the rookie. Sits two strokes under par. James McNulty, the woman golfer on the PGA. Anything's possible anymore. Right is left, left is right. And we're finding the fairway. Oh, unfortunate. Hitting some rough. Not ultimately concerning. Good recovery. They keep the grass well kept here. Sawgrass. Much to popular belief, uh, the grass is not kept with a saw. They cut it with mowers. Five hundred and ten yard par five. Hole eleven. Straight away drive here. No problem whatsoever. Two hundred and seventy nine yards stays consistent. Opportunity to get on in under regulation. But he's going for the beach, and he just gets a great kick. Great kick out of there. Manageable birdie putt. Sinks it. Ice in his veins today. Sitting only one stroke behind Lance Sharp. Coming into hole 12. It's a very short par 4. Let's see what the driver looks like here. Great shot to sky the sand, and he does. In fact, he drives the green. Sets up an eagle putt. About 30 feet away. 32 to be precise. Quite a lot of right to the left break early on. It's uphill both ways. Good lag. Sets up a very easy birdie putt. Sinks it easy. He's now top tied for first on the leaderboard. Let's take a look at his scorecard. Only one bogey for the day. Sitting five under. Good start to the back nine. Lance Sharp finishing up there. The rookie's going to need to get himself under a couple more strokes if he wants to win this. This is well struck going for the cup. Oh, and he just misses the flag. Seems to be straight away downhill. Sinks it. That should give him sole possession of the lead. There he sits. Only Sean Hood and Charles Mas Marston's left to go. Has a commanding lead over them. If he can hold this, he should be crowned the champion. Not looking good. Heading for the water. Gonna need to drive this one again. Sitting here on his third stroke. Needs to really 
hit this one well. Indeed he does. Very unfortunate. This could cost him later on. Going to need to recover. Expect the two putt here. As is predicted. Sad to say the least, how the mighty have fallen. Lance Sharp, don't hold out hope yet. only one stroke behind you strikes it well sitting along on the fairway nine iron should get him here needs to take a little fat with him expect some loft he strokes it well gonna be right at the cup Sitting about pin long, maybe a little longer. Oh, very poorly played. You expect to see more. And he's going to three putt, maybe four putt this. Continue to slide down the leaderboard. Thinks it for the bogey. With that hole and the hole previous, he now sits two strokes behind Lance Sharp and one stroke behind Donald McDonald. This isn't looking good for the rookie. Needs to stay in the fairway here. Indeed. Not going to be enough. Oh, it is. In fact, it's too long. Still manageable. Eagle putt coming right up. Uphill slightly right to left. And he sinks it. Good momentum going into the later holes. Tied back with Lance Sharp. Two holes to go. Here comes the iconic 17th hole at Sawgrass. Strikes it well. Does he get the roll he needs? Indeed he does not. Tough birdie putt. Not enough leg on it. We'll manage par here. Now we've got a final showdown going into the 18th. The rookie versus himself. Can he hold it? Or does he get the birdie he needs to win this himself? Only time will tell. Par four. Wind picked up a little bit. He's going to lay in right of the fairway. Hoping the wind will take it a little. And then... Does not, unfortunately. Compensated a little too much for the win. An 8 to 10 foot birdie putt. Quite a lot of left to right. Misses it. Doesn't have the gumption. Takes a share of the Players' Championship home with Lance Sharp.
Well, we'd like to thank you for tuning in. We wish you the best of luck this evening. Have a great evening.